Also, no, another thing, another another thing I was learning was uh, all, all of the the cast the cast from uh the movie, the movies not nightmare nightmare on nightmare on nightmare on Elm Street, yeah those movies from nightmare on on Elm Street uh, I think all the actors that like because I know the movies weren't made in like around here I think I was learning, all the actual actors that are around here from that bloodline like I think one of them's like a Kaplan like that woman, Lisa Zane. And I think she could be made possibly, possibly like a pure blood Kaplan, possibly or something like that. And that one around here, I think I did learn was about a one percent. And like the whole thing about nightmare on Elm Street, like when you wake up this division system, the ranking system, it's like a nightmare. Uh, a little bit, uh, maybe some like amount for something. Uh, like I said, eventually like some lower one percent. So like like I said, uh. You no, know, it was something like this, where, uh, you know, I'm pretty sure I did learn these two archangels in my body, uh, may, maybe are, are call are named, uh, Ur Uriel, Uriel and, and Amy, Amy, possibly, but it was, uh, it was not a lie where, um, and yeah, these angels are trying to stop me from talking again, but like I said, I'm pretty sure I did see they will leave, but just know God and Jesus, yeah, even in my dream today, Yesterday, uh, Jesus and God were saying, like, uh, the dream said, it's like, it says, it basically said, uh, it basically said, uh, like, oh yeah, and it looks like it's like, like in the in my dream, it basically said, well, like, real well, that said, it looks like it's God's game, but it's like, really not, we say it's God's game, but it's like, really like, whoever's in control of the demons, uh, like I said, everyone agreed to everything here, so it wasn't like this. But eventually it was something like this where it was way more, uh... Like I said, it's way more real what, uh... What, what was, like, how you'd see that type of world. Where it's, like, not like some superior... Where it's not like some superior perfect god. Uh, where it is, like, the, a world a world of, like, a very, uh, pitied being. Like, a very... Like, in that the, uh, the ranking system, division... The bottom one percent world, like this is what you'll see. You can see it really well. Uh, is the thing as far as I saw, but it was like that where it wasn't a lie. Eventually, what I did understand was like out of the bottom one percent, there's like maybe like thirty or forty, fifty beings, like God and Death and Four Horsemen. I think are there, where the same thing as Death and God, and they're like I think some the real gods out there are like cool, but just know from what I learned, like after this, uh, or it was something like that. Where they did do something to God and those other beings, uh, like death and the, and the forty at the bottom, where they made them almost like like bad smells. Or there's some system that only these beings that are so smited and punished, that only only they're the only the hand only like them will do like God's position and uh, death that death's position and four horsemen's position. Also, the four horsemen are always watching anyone watching this channel, so they're always commanding on you. There's like four, so one of them's always watching you. He's always looking at the future and, and and the past and like anyone could do this from from what I saw the demons can. So they're always watching you if you watch my stuff and they're always commanding demons to use their powers on you. A real important thing to do is buy a ruby crystal I think because it was a uh, does hurt the demons in your head I think. Uh, and I, I, I like I said it was maybe important but yeah, I I know it was as far as I saw but also doing that head shake thing uh, it was real important. That in the end the head shake thing was all I need to do in the daytime when you think about God. But the head shake thing was uh, something that will let them know you're there. But it wasn't a joke, that head shake thing. Just know. Yeah, I think it was like almost worse than the crystal maybe a little. Cause they, and this is what I kept having to do. But it was very important to do this. They'll know you're there if you do it long, uh, enough times throughout the day. Like if you do it like every... I mean like I said, maybe for like 10 minutes if you keep doing it for a little bit. Just know it's real important to let them know you're there. Uh, I don't know. I saw they were there like I said. And like I said, it's, 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 it's really it's still angels and demons here. But it was very important, uh, you know, from what I learned also, there's other beings, like, I think it's like, like, God said the archangels in my body, uh, Jesus and God said the archangels in my body were, like, deep bottom 1%, which were, like, point, it's, like, something like point 0.1 or point 0.2, point 0.3 or something at the bottom of the 1%, essentially is what that would mean, uh, but from what I learned, there was, like, the whole, like, the whole bottom 0.3% also are, like, in this game where they're, like, doing stuff, like I said, what they're doing to me, is gonna end up make some someone like like I said other angels from other planets, like Earth, uh, and uh, that that do this position because I think it's only two. And I think Jesus said that in my dream that there's only twelve of them using their powers, on the ones in my body, and it's like 
something like 12 and like that is like two there are hundreds of angels but no one does this part necessarily uh, but it was like that where like the whole bottom 0.3% of the like the of, like basically like half of the bottom 1% are risking becoming god and death and getting those bottom like 60 positions the, the 60 beings at the bottom they're risking becoming that some of them were I think but like just know it's real, real way more real what I'm hearing about I think how like no one has sex with sex with the bottom 60 beings uh, they never will, uh, they never will again is almost what I understood was like basically the thing because of what their system's like with gas and like and stuff like that. So it's like that where it's like really not a joke what uh, the real god, the real gods don't like gas or whatever but sometimes they're like, I don't know, I don't know if the real god, the real god doesn't always like to see this, maybe not that much because it's like entertaining. But it's like, in the end he wants to keep a cool universe I think to where it's like cool you know so it's like, but this is what the, I think god was understanding. If you saw what happened to God and death, how they like really do maybe like bad smells, like actually almost like them exactly, or where they actually do like it, like bad smells, bad smells, and like feet and stuff. And then it's like you would understand what the real God. Or, or they've also these two movies called The Collector. If you look at uh, look at uh Bray Wyatt's Firefly Funhouse, that was Abby Abigail, the little doll Abigail, was metaphoring the real God because that that was a metaphor like Abigail from uh. From Salem Witch Trials or whatever, which is on the east side, which is metaphors like the best beings. And then it was a, uh, and then it was like looks like a girly guy, kind of half guy, half girl, because that's the, that's what they suspect the real God to be. It was like a guy and a girl half the time. Because I think God is this, and everyone everyone else is this. Like Jesus, me, like one day it'll be a girl. But like I said, it was like this, where it was uh way more real. What the God sees, how he never will be a top one percent. Top two percent, uh, cause of what the real God and this movie, The Collector. If you watch the movie The Collector, that was the metaphor. He was like in a gimp uh, outfit, ha, ha, mask thing. Cause that was the metaphor. It was like, uh, like he, like that was the thing. How he's like, he, like yeah, like having sex with him would be the most arousing, cause he's all powerful and can over overtake like all the gods or like any god that God knows about. Or like I'm a god, not like a real god. Is what I kept hearing. So it was like that where the collector was the thing where they think that three percents now they know they don't think this but they think most of the time you, you'll exist in the future will be without division it you won't have to be in wars or in a, mole, a molecule an object so they figure that the real god saw things are so good too good that he was just doing some game like this for a while where everyone does agree to be in wars does agree to you know be and this is what i think i was learning everyone agrees to get killed by a tornado where a tornado come through your house to like in some in your house in like oklahoma and then it like rips, it like kills you, and like you get your body gets like like in the end of Chucky. If you watch the end of the Child's Play three movie, Child's Play three movie, I think that's something that really happens where everyone agrees with that. But yeah, that was something that uh, you should. I don't know. This is something I think I learned. But yeah, hold on.